Barbara Tuesday to answer your questions. It's been a while guys. I haven't done a Queen's Corner in like a month and a half. So I'm really excited to be back and I decorated my corner up for Christmas. I'm so excited. Let's get to your questions. I haven't done this in a long time. How do I do it? I'm so excited. What's your favorite Christmas movie? Okay, my favorite Christmas movie is Elf. And I know that that's like everyone's favorite Christmas movie, but it's so good. I also love um, How the Grinch Stole Christmas, the cartoon. I like the Jim Carrey version too, but the cartoon is like total goals. You also said, can't wait till you come to New Orleans. I can't wait to come to New Orleans. I'm going with Joshua. We're doing a big tour. So I'm really nervous and I'm really excited and hope you guys all go. So if you guys want to come see us, please get tickets. There's still tickets left. It'll be me and Josh and of course Miranda. Would ever up Upload a Miranda video without having her lipstick or any makeup on. I would never upload a Miranda video without lipstick because then it's not Miranda, it's just me. Hey guys, it's me Miranda. That is not Miranda. It still looks like me, even if I don't have the lipstick on. Don't you think? I don't know. Were you homeschooled your whole childhood or just part of it? Love you so much. Love you too. I was homeschooled for just a couple of years. For sixth, seventh, and eighth grade, I was homeschooled, and that's it. Here's a photo of what I looked like when I was homeschooled. Isn't that great? Have you ever been skinny dipping? And if not, who would you go with and why? I have been skinny dipping. I've only been skinny dipping once, and it was with Glozelle Green. I went to a day spa with Glozelle once a couple of years ago, and I actually vlogged it. We skinny dipped in the hot tub together, and we were laughing hysterically the whole time, trying to put like little tiny hand towels over our business. One of the first times I really felt like, oh my God, this woman is incredible and is my best friend. Not because I saw her naked, but because, wait, this sounds bad. <laughs> it sounds like I was like, I saw this woman naked and then I was like, realized how incredible she was. No, I love you, Glozelle. You have a beautiful body, but that's not what I mean. That was a time in my life when I was realizing how incredible Glozelle is and I love her so much and we created a really great bond and I miss her. I don't see her often anymore, so I need to call her so we can go skinny dipping again. Hey Glow, you down? What is your favorite food? My favorite food is um, anything that is food. <laughs> Now I'm gonna go to Instagram. What's your eye color? I have the eye color of poop. See that? That's the color of poop, ladies and gentlemen. I'm always jealous of people with brown eyes who have like pretty like hazel brown or chestnut brown. Mine just like brown. <laughs> no other descriptive word that describes my eye color. It is just poop. Can you please do a bit all about your honeymoon book? All right, when Josh, first of all, that sounds really weird, but when Josh and I were on our honeymoon, we kept a journal about our travels. Let me show you some of the pages. Here is my honeymoon book. Here's a page. Joshua is burnt and naked. There's a flower taped into the book, and it says, I wore this flower in my hair tonight when we reset our vows on the beach tonight. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna cry. That was such a sweet night. Oh, look at this. This is my wedding band that I wore on our wedding day. This is the wedding band we used at our wedding. We are getting the real one made in Georgia in a couple months. This one was a couple bucks and it turned my finger green, so I had to take it off. I threw it away originally and instantly felt so sad. I didn't think I would feel such a connection to something so cheap and momentary, but I guess love does that to you. I'm glad that I now have it forever. <laughs> Anyway, this goes on and on and on. There's so many pages. If you guys want me to do like a full video reading um, different journals, because I do this with pretty much every tour I've done, everywhere I've gone in the world, I do these journal things. So if you guys want me to do a video where I just kind of read journals to you, let me know. What happened to Vlogmas? I don't know, I'm doing it. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing vlogs right now on my vlog channel. So if you wanna see me vlogging every single day, you can go subscribe over there, the link's below. Do you have a PO box? I would love to send something to you. I do have a PO box. If you send me something to my PO box, that's great, I love it. We open every single thing. My mom's in charge of my PO box and she goes there every single day and opens everything up and shows me everything. She like organizes it all for me. So if you wanna send me something, you can. I just probably won't be able to write you back because we literally get thousands of mail. <laughs> Thousands of mails? Thousands? Thousands of mails. So it's truly impossible for me to write everyone back. If you send something, I'll get it, I'll see it, I'll love it, but I'm not gonna write you back because I can't. What's Colleen's Snapchat? My Snapchat is ColleenB123. Speaking of Snapchat, let's get some questions from there. You look so dramatic and so stunning. I feel like the question that should go with this picture is like, why didn't I change to Geico when I had the chance? Someday he'll come back to me. 
but the question is actually where in the world do you want to go to the most? I really want to go to Italy. I've never been to Italy and um, it just looks beautiful. I'd love to check it out. Will you be my BFF? Yes, I will. You look very fun. Are you gonna have any merch at your Christmas shows, like phone cases? Oh my God, the Christmas show is in one week, you guys. Holy smokes. Okay, so we're doing a Christmas show in Santa Barbara and two in San Jose. I think the San Jose ones are sold out, but there's still tickets in Santa Barbara. Yes, we're selling lots of different Christmas merch. Ornaments, t-shirts, books, posters, everything is signed and it's all gonna be great. We are dying of laughter writing it. We're, my whole entire family is putting on tutus and we're reenacting the Nutcracker. So hope you guys get tickets. How many pets have you had in your life? I have had so many pets. I've had mice, rats, iguana, guinea pigs, a tarantula, bunnies, snakes, finches, doves, to say cats, dogs, chickens, fish. I'm sure I'm forgetting something. Those are the ones I can remember. We've had a lot, a lot of pets. Favorite Christmas ornament. This picture <laughs> made me laugh so hard when I opened this snap. Whenever you guys send me like fake smiles or gross faces on Snapchat, it makes me laugh so hard, so thank you. This year, I think this one might be my favorite. It's uh, Josh and I got it because we got married this year. And it says just married on it. It has Mickey and Minnie because I'm obsessed with Disneyland. So I've also been super into making ornaments. So I made this and this one. I also made this ornament this year. I don't know, I'm just super into crafts. So I've made tons of different ornaments. But anyway, I've been really enjoying making ornaments. Well, that's all the questions I'm gonna answer for you guys today. I hope you like this episode of Colleen's Corner. I am back and running every single Tuesday. I will be here answering your questions and doing weird things. And that's all I gotta say about that. See you Friday. Bye. Wait, why did I say that so weird? Bye. <laughs> it makes me happy to have Christmas.